put this on top see just nice make it make your fish feel comfortable cooking up hi this is cooking up today i have a beautiful uh, grouper fish tail with me probably about 600 gram quite a big one very thick very fresh so what we do, i'm going to do teochew's thing as you all know appa is a teochew uh any of you are also teochew do comment in the uh, comment section yeah let appa know so um after you wash the fish what you do is you uh, give a few cut a few slits on the fish body like this and sprinkle a little bit of salt on top to uh, marinate it then we can start decorating <laughs> our uh, steaming plate uh, because when you do Teochew steam, it's a little bit different than normal. So this is my steaming plate. Uh, there are a few things you can see here. Uh, number one, you need to get a, a relatively big and uh, with a little bit of depth yeah, because it's going to have some sauce when it steams together. Uh, then uh, I actually put in the middle some uh, pickled veggie, okay, uh, ham choy, pickled veggie and also a few pieces of ginger. Why I put in the middle? Because later I'm going to use this to actually raise the fish up. We want to raise your fish up so that the fish can be steamed more evenly. And also, of course, I also wanted the flavor of the ham choy, um, pickled veggie together with the ginger to go into the steel juice uh, steam sauce. Then I put a few pieces of <coughs> tomato chunks at the side and also some tofu, yeah, nice soft tofu. So what you do after that, put this on top. See, just nice. Make it, make your fish feel comfortable. After that, we are going to make the sauce. <clears throat> so first of all, I'm going to put in some uh, warm water here. Right. Next thing, this is salted plum, and surprisingly, salted plum is what really give it immediate sourish flavor, especially the sauce. So you also want to add in some of the sauce from the salted plum. This is going to make it very, very sour immediately. Uh, if you want to, depending on your uh, sour veggie, the pickle veggie, not so fast. The one have to really cook it for quite some time, yeah? After that, I'm going to give it a few dashes of my uh, uh, premium Vietnamese fish sauce. Okay. Also, we are going to top it up with some ginger slices. So at the bottom, there are also some ginger here. Yeah? Right. Last but not least, few dashes of white pepper right then you can go into the steamer so make sure you have your steamer is uh, the water is boiling then very very slowly and carefully put in the fish after which I'm going to close the lid so there's a little bit of opening at the side, it's perfectly fine. And I'm going to use a medium high heat to uh, steam this for a minimum about 12 minutes. 12 to uh, around 12 minutes plus minus because the fish is very thick. Uh, if the fish is smaller, probably you want to steam it for probably about 10 minutes plus minus. Yeah. This is after 12 minutes uh, steaming under medium high heat. Look at the beautiful whitish color of this fish. It is uh, definitely ready. If you are not sure, uh, <clears throat> all you need to do is uh, use uh, something sharp and to see you can actually poke through the fish or not. Yeah. If you cannot poke through, then you uh, continue to steam it for a little bit longer, a minute or two. So very carefully, I'm going to take out the fish. Right, this is the fish with the Teochew steamy sauce. And notice I did not, um, like what I used to do, which is to remove the fishy water. Uh, so make sure this fish 
you really want to use some fish that you are 100% sure is very, very fresh. Let's give it some uh, red chili on top. And we can finish off with a little bit of garlic oil. Just a little bit. Right, done. So this is cooking up our um, Teochew steam fish. You can also put in the soaked shiitake mushroom. So if you like my video, do share my video on your Facebook to your friends. Come cooking up our Facebook fan page to click like and follow button. Follow up on Instagram and subscribe to Cooking Up YouTube channel. Thank you very much. Bye bye.